Hey guys, um, I just wanted to hop on here and say hi. I'm going to be coloring my hair, just probably like a pink or something. So I decided that I'll take you along with me. So if you want to see how I do it, then just keep on watching. Okay, I know it's really bad lighting, I'm sorry. But I'm going to color my hair. Um, I'm going to use um, the Pearl Pastel it's a semi-permanent rose gold, so I'm really excited for this. I think it'll be a fun color. It's only going to last, like, um, um, probably 8 to 12 washes for me. And I'm just going to light my new um, first frost candle from Bath & Body Works. This is my favorite scent ever. It's, like, um, a very, like, manly scent, like cologne. But it's really, really nice. It's a really nice smell. I've been breaking out so bad. This one has been here forever. But, yeah. Okay, I'm going to get started, and I'll be right back. Okay, I just brushed my hair out. And this is what we got. Sorry about the lighting. I know it's really bad. But, here we go. I've done um like colors like this before, so I'm excited, but I've never done um like rose gold. And I tend to naturally pull out of gold. So we'll see what happens. Um it's just like a very light color, so I'm not really worried about wearing gloves. Yeah. Okay, so I applied it all. Um, it's looking pretty pink. I'm excited. Here, I'll give you better light. Not that it's better light. But yeah, I'm excited. Um, I'm going to let it sit for 20 minutes. And then we'll wash. Hey guys, so I'm back. I never finished um, filming like the color that I did. It's kind of washed out now a bit, but it was kind of like a hue of pink to it. So it kind of just has like the rose gold effect, um, more so than like the platinum look. So I'm just getting ready to go um, head out the door. And I decided that I would just do my hair quickly and kind of show you what I usually do. And just like take you along with me. So yeah, I'm just going to curl my hair, start at the bottom. I have like third day old hair, so it's going to need some dry shampoo. I'm just using about a two inch curling iron and I'm just kind of like waving it and leaving out the ends. Like I want that blown out effect, but not so much the I curled it fully, if that makes sense. So yeah. I'm just going to curl the rest of my hair, and then I'll kind of show you the rest from there. So I just finished curling um, the past couple sections. I kind of curled it all away from my face, just because I don't really want any towards my face. So from here, I'm going to go in with some of the Kardashian Beauty, so it's just like a leave-in, sorry, it's not a leave-in, it's a, like a dry conditioner, so it's just going to add some shine to my hair. It smells really good. And I find this just helps when I'm using, <coughs> when I'm using, um, a lot of dry shampoo during the week it just gives it that shine that you can see throughout there and I find it just helps give it some life again um, but yeah I'm just kind of going for that blown out effect um, I'll probably go in and just tease it a bit 
add a little bit more detail to it. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I just wanted a little bit of movement in there. And I find this piece, there's always that one piece that doesn't want to curl. I feel like everybody's hair has it. And mine is the piece in the front that never wants to curl. And then I'm just going to finish it off with the Joyco hairspray. Um, it's a pretty strong hold, so you don't need a lot. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I just, I love the messy look. Um, some people don't like it or aren't a fan of it, but everybody likes something different. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I'll probably take you guys along with me the rest of the day, so keep on watching.